What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to use these new smooth transitions. What's different about these is that you actually use them as title layers, which is amazing because it clears up the timeline and it's so much quicker and easier to add these onto your project and also layer them to create different transitions. It just makes life so much easier and it's definitely how I'm going to edit in the future on Final Cut Pro. To install these, you need to save them in your motion templates titles folder because it is a title plugin. To find that, I'm going to go to Finder, I'm going to click up here to go, and then I'm going to go to Home, Movies, Motion Templates, and then Titles, and you just want to save them in your Titles folder. I've got them saved right there. So this pack comes with the Zoom In and Zoom Out transition, the Slide Left, Right, up and down and also the spin transitions anti-clockwise and clockwise and you can also mix all of these transitions to create different directions and different effects so there's pretty much like 30 different transitions you can get from this pack okay so once you've downloaded and saved the folder in your titles folder you just want to go up here to your titles tab and go to titles and it will pop up in there so there it is smooth layers smooth transition layers. What I've done is numbered these one and two. So the number one will be the start of the transition and we'll go on the first clip and then the number two of that transition will go on the second clip. So I want to zoom in on this on these two shots into that lake. So all I'm going to do is just find the zoom in number one. I'm going to place that right there and just like that and then I'm going to get the zoom in number two and just place that on the other side of it and then that's going to give me a smooth zoom transition and it's just as easy as that and it's not going to mess up my timeline like normal transitions do and also a quick tip is you can also add motion blur to this so if you go to titles this is a free plugin motion blur plugin and I like to use the moderate motion blur too. And if we add that over, over this transition, it's gonna give it a really nice like natural motion blur, just like that. If I disable that, you can see. So yeah, using these title transitions and the motion blur, it's gonna get you some really nice looking transitions. If you click on these titles and you go up to the right hand side on the uh, publish parameters, you can actually change the zoom amount as well. So lots of room for like creativity here. So let's add another one here and let's, I'll show you how you can mix these together really easily to create some cool transitions. So let's go to smooth layers and I'm gonna create the zoom spin transition. I actually did this video a couple of weeks ago with actual transitions and it was so much harder than what it is now. So let's just add in this zoom one to this first shot, zoom in two after that. So then we've got we've got the zoom in. And then I'm just gonna add the spin. Where's the spin clockwise number one? Add that on top, spin clockwise two, just like that. And then I'm gonna add motion blur to that. Just right there. I'm gonna render that out quickly. And there you go, you've got a really nice looking zoom spin transition right there. Got the nice motion blur. So yeah, there you go guys, that is new smooth zoom transitions. This is a paid plugin. Um, I will slowly release these for free, but if you wanna get them now, then I've made them super affordable for you guys. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.